Hey guys, how's it going? Kermode here. In this video, I want to show you guys how you can improve your plucks. Plucks is such an important part of electronic music, and I think too many people are doing it far too simply. I think that just having a single patch with maybe just a low pass square wave is too simple unless you're going for that sound but i think more can be done so uh i want to show you guys my track symbols real quick and i want to show you guys the verse specifically so let's take a listen Now that pluck, I am really proud of. I actually really like that pluck. Uh, it feels kind of organic, synthetic, wood, metal. It's kind of got a bit of everything. And there's a lot going on in it. Now I'm not gonna show you specifically how to make this pluck. I'm not a fan of that. I would rather teach you guys how to fish than give you the fish. And how to fish is quite simple. The technique is all about layering and specifically layering both the synthetic and the organic. So many of you have some sort of way of triggering sampled instruments. Uh, maybe you have contact, maybe you have Ableton stock sampler library. There's lots of ways you can get a hold of real organic pluck type sounds. And uh, when you combine both synthetic and organic, you get a really beautiful hybrid. Let's take a listen to this sound. Now the processing on it is quite simple. There's just a bit of drum bus, adding a bit of, uh, you know, turning up the body a little bit. There's a delay for some nice rhythm. Uh, another drum bus doing the same thing. A little bit of saturation doesn't even look like it's on. Maybe it's... I'm just clipping off a little bit of the sound going into the red, a little bit of EQ, and a tool I really like called Soothe. Uh, with all of them off, our sound's going to sound barely any different. Yeah, you, you don't get the delay, that's about it. So let's actually take a look at the sound, what's going on. So it all st stemmed from this first serum patch. which is very simple. This is just a Cymatics preset. I don't know if it's one that I made when I worked at Cymatics or if it's just from a pack, but as you can see, incredibly simple. And that's where I find people fall flat. They usually leave it at that. They're like, oh, this is a really good pluck patch. What happens when you layer it with more? We also have a different preset, an octave above just barely layered in there. Let's turn that up. So that's giving a little bit of brightness to it. You can just barely hear it on the top. Then next we have this sound here, a Celesta. But you'll notice that it's got almost no tail. I probably went in and changed the volume envelope here so that it's really short. Here we have the same thing an octave above. So you'll notice a lot of duplication and uh, turning up an octave. Here we just have the body of the Celeste. And then lastly, a xylophone. Now all of these are stock contact factory library sounds. But together, the layering, let's just start to bring them in one at a time. None of them sound good on their own. Honestly, pretty lame on their own. That one's all right because it's the nice reverb tail. 
But here without the synthetic layer, we're, we're really missing that just fundamental pure tone. So you can't really go one way or the other. You need the synthetic, you need the organic. And together you get this perfect sound. So my recommendation, create a nice melody, create a simple serum patch, but then from there start to layer more serum patches, some contact libraries, other things, but make sure that when heard together, they're not distinctly different. They're still pretty similar. Like when you hear this, you wouldn't know that there's six different layers going on. It sounds like one very pure tone. So there we go, guys. That's how I make my EDM plucks. It's a lot of layering, but I find that makes things, you know, really uh, unique and a nice hybrid of synthetic and organic. So if you liked this, please go check out the track uh, this technique is demonstrated from, Symbols. It's off my Universe LP. I'll drop it in the description below, and uh, I'll be back soon with another video. Thanks again, guys. Peace.